Hello, hello, hello. Here I am again. 500 Boston shops. If you notice, I'm trying to get uh, see how you see how I'm wearing my hat, and uh, you know, check out this from my little scarf for a minute. I'm I'm trying to uh, uh, get into a character. Uh, my first degree was in drama, and I was like, hmm. I thought that was a booger, but if you see you see that thing there, that's a gray hair. That's, see all that in there? That's a gray hair. Um, I, I, I've got my degree in drama, and the thing is, I was one of the first, yes, yes, one of the first blacks to get a... Uh, uh, degree from Tufts in, 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 the, in drama. There was a, a, a guy from Kenya, an African. I think he got a, a degree for, in drama at Tufts. I remember when I was 19, that was my uh, 19 years old, and that was my, yes, my, my freshman year at Tufts University. And I went, my a friend of mine, I had, I had Go, going to touch to be a lawyer. Everybody, all my brothers and sisters, they became lawyers, but I, I started off thinking that I wanted to be a lawyer, but then I said, no, nah, that, that stuff was boring. So I ended up studying drama. I would like to share this with you. My first day, I, I know the, my first day, I, I was taking a technical theater course, and the, uh, the white teacher, I, in that case, I was the only black, you know, it's, it's, it's really pitiful how, how they how they treat black people when they can get when they think when they think they can get away with it. He looked up. This this was a teacher, grown man. Oh, look at that! That's, that's gray hair. You see that? That's gray hair coming out my nose. Not a boo. He looked up at me. I was the only black in the class, and he said to the whole class, he said, "Even a Negro can make it in drama." Ooh wee. Why did he, what, what was that all about? I mean, why was that necessary? I wrote him a note. I, said, I wrote him a note. I said, look, have you ever heard of Sammy Davis Jr., Sidney Poitier? I named all of the people in drama that I knew. And he said, well, I'll tell you what. I think you better drop this class. I got pushed around quite a bit in that department. In fact, I was in a play uh, uh, with William Hurt. William Hurt, he, he's a, a white my movie star. He, he, well, he's, he's to see. He was my classmate. Well, anyway, the, the 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 graduate student wrote a play, and the thing is, I they, I was in the play, and you know, I said nothing in the whole play. I just walked around and said, mm, mm, mm. I would nod my head, and my girlfriend said, when well, she saw it, she said, well, Why is it you never say anything? I said, I don't know. I'm just talking history now. But I'm just saying, uh, I have experienced times in my life when I'm saying this person went out of his way to to insult me as a black person. I don't, oh, there's another time I was walk, I was working somewhere. I must have been in, in, in Atlanta, and the guy kept saying, "Oh man, I'm not gonna bother you because you're black." I said, no, I'm, not, I'm not even worried about you, but this man would keep saying that. He said, "Oh, I'm not gonna, don't worry, I'm, I'm not gonna." Uh, there's a serious problem here. But I have, I have to deal with one problem at a time. I remember, I'm, I'm a freshman at this. I just started this my broadcasting. And would you believe it or not, I've got 80 views. But you know what the 80 views were on? I, I took a picture of it raining in Providence uh, on the bus. And I took the picture of the turkeys in Warren, uh, in, on, uh, in, in Warren and Roxbury. I got more views on those than my, the views of, of my speaking. I said, I mean, look, I got 80 views. I just started. I haven't been in, 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 in the YouTube business over, two, what, two weeks. Uh, I got 80 views when I filmed my bus ride in Providence when it was raining down. And I got a bunch of views when I showed the, the turkeys in, in the street. But when I'm talking, I get no views. So what I'm going to have to do is I'm going to have to mix my show up with just photographs. You know, maybe I'll just be, I'll do a little photographs here and there. And maybe I can inc increase my 
viewership. And even I got a comment. Look, I just started doing this. I got a comment. I comment. I just started. And with the, I, the comment was something about, well, why was I? What was the reason for my showing the storm in Providence? Look, I had nothing else to do, and I got 80 views in, in 24 hours. I said, wow. So that tells me exactly how I should deal with my show, and I will be uh, doing a lot to try to satisfy my viewing audience. But I would like you to take note. I'm doing my, my website. And I was I, I trying to figure out a way that my viewership would be able to see my marvelous work. In other words, I do all my work, I, my computer work. I, I, in other words, I designed my uh, uh, website and I'm working on it. And I, I eventually have it international. I'm just trying to figure out a way to make sure that my YouTube viewers see what, what I'm all about. Because you probably think I'm just a stupid, a little ignorant old man or something. Well, maybe I am a little bit. But... I said that there was something that I really wanted to talk about when I, I, I oh, oh I, I'm at Boston Street, nice day and everything, and I'm alone, and I'm and the thing is I'm, I may be running out of time, so I may have to start this over. I, I, I would like for my viewership, what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn clock out and then I'm going to clock back in. I want to see just how I look on my, on my on my show. I'm going to clock out and I clock back in. I, I check with you.